So, Pumla, as we sit here right now, uh, the children are in the are in the classroom by themselves. Mm -hmm. There's about what? There's about of uh, twenty five. Oh, yeah, there are 30 of them yeah. right, right now. And I've given them a, a short play. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I do audio drama, but I've given them a short play. Mm -hmm. And they're just working on themselves, with themselves. There's no supervision. Mm -hmm. it's, I guess they call it peer-to-peer -peer or whatever yeah, they're calling yeah, it these yeah, days. Yeah. Uh, but they're working on it because it's, 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 it's written in English, but also it has a it's, it's, it's it's also, mm -hmm. translation mm -hmm. right under it, the way, the, the way it is. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's about, it's, the play is called, um, or the, the piece is called Eyes on Their Feet. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's an autochthonous tale, and it was a, a tale from this region, from, from the southern African region. Mm -hmm. I forgot, I think it's the Venda people, I'm not really sure what, 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 what people, what nation, uh, what tribe it's from. But they're working on it, so mm -hmm. I think we're going to just try it for the, for, the, um, for the rest of the semester, just to work on that play. Because the way it ends, the play, the person is, sort of has to go out of the community. Mm -hmm. So what the, my idea is for them to work on a play, but since they work so much on it, mm -hmm. for them to provide another ending. Mm -hmm. In other words, what happens after the person goes out to the community, mm -hmm. out of the community. Mm -hmm. So I don't know, what, what do you think about that? Do you think that they'll, they'll be able to work on that? Yeah, they will be able to work with that because they, they really, um, they don't like, like things on theory, theoretical or writing kind. But they want to do things, you know, uh, action kind, you know. So they are really enthusiastic, you know, enthusiastic into into the play's drama, mm -hmm. you know. And you can give them the lines, you know, but they extend it, you know, mm -hmm. and put it. But they don't running away from the content, mm -hmm. you know, of of the play or mm -hmm. drama, you know. Yeah. They love working with the, with the drama mm -hmm. these kids and. Mm -hmm. Even if you are not here, you know, I have, you have, you have to hear them singing the, for themselves, by themselves, mm -hmm. you know. Oh, the song we made up last yeah, year, the village the, song. The village song, uh, yeah. you know. <laughs> you know, I had the idea, because, you know, we, we, have, we have religious songs mm -hmm. in South Africa. We have religious songs. We have struggle songs, of course. And I was asking, well, don't, can't we make up a village song? So they made up a village song. Mm -hmm. And I think in the play, they can put the village song. They put everything in the play. Yeah, they, 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 put it, they put it. <laughs> they put it, they love it, man, you know, but I'm really, I'm really cool, man, because that's the only way that the, that the kids can express um, uh, themselves through drama, through art, you know, they are, they are also specialists in, 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 in fine art. Yeah, what kind of art do they do? They do fine art? They do fine art, they do craft work, they also do um, drama. They drama, do they dance? They do dance, singing, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. you know, and we also are having a, some a group that will do that uh, up and coming from the university. Gardening, they are specialists, they specialize in gardening, they love gardening, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, they, there's a group who coming from the university, and they also gonna provide with somebody who's high skilled in in beat work, you know, and we've got beat in our program we've got beat work, mm -hmm. and also the sewing. You know, mm -hmm. and then we've got the sewing machines, you know. Mm -hmm. So they, they are busy organizing for us, you know, mm -hmm. because we are organized by myself, and people, they come here and they help the children, and after that, at the end of the month, they come to me and say, Pumla, where's the money? I say that the money you're going to provide by yourselves, because you get 100%, then the 60% will be yours, and then the 40% will be for the program, mm -hmm. you know. And they agree with that. They, they, they run away. Yeah. They run away. They want 100%. They want 100%. And we provide the kids uh, that is a human asset. And also, I provide them a working material. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I mean, so can, can't thing? you explain that, you know, the material costs so much that we, we need more material for other people? And that's why you have to give some back? They don't understand that point. They don't understand that point, you know. So I'm sure that these people, the, the guys from the university, will also, I mean, uh, try to catch up on that, you know, because I told them everything about the center. Mm -hmm. And then they promised that there will be some current volunteer who can understand and come maybe or Wednesday or Thursdays or whatsoever at any given time, you know, and give some share, the skill that she have mm -hmm. with the kids. You know, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Sure, sir.